Welcome to our video series outlining our Kipware QTE cost estimating software. In this initial video, what we're going to do is uh, give you an outline of the software, kind of a quick uh, down and dirty look at how the software works. And then in each of the videos in the series, we're going to go in depth in each one of the areas uh, involved in Kipware QTE. Kipware QTE is designed to prepare a, in the end result, to prepare a quotation that you can send off to your customer. And what we're going to do inside the software is create a cost estimate that's going to account for material cost, perishable tooling cost, labor cost, and all non-machining costs that are involved in the manufacture of the part. So the menu bar works from left to right, and each one of these areas is covered inside the software. And we're going to go in-depth at each one of those areas uh, within this video series. At any time during the estimate, you can use the Calculate Cost screen to look at the estimate that you're creating. Uh, you can see the high areas of where the cost is being incurred. Uh, you can see an in-depth description. In this particular case, if we look at labor cost, we can see in-depth description of each one of the operations involved in the machining of the part, how much it's going to cost, how many hours are going to be involved. Uh, we can look at all the tooling that we've decided, perishable tooling, uh, that are involved in the uh, manufacture of the part. And we can take a look at our non-machining costs. So this is the Calculate Cost screen as you're going through creating the estimate. When the cost estimate is done, you can create a quotation with up to six different quantities. So what we do is we start with a base quantity and then we can give up to six different quantities. The software will automatically amortize everything over those quantities uh, that you've got in, in the uh, base quantity estimate. So you can prepare a quotation. When you want to print the quotation or send it off to the customer, you can print it in our pre-formatted quote form. You can save the quotation to a CSV file so you can import it into Excel, or you can save it as a text file. Each one of these uh, particular cases, uh, you can output it to a PDF file using an external application. So you can uh, go right from QTE to a PDF to an email where you can send it off to your customer. Under the order processing features of Kipware QTE, we can create a bill of materials. So when the job is won, you can use the estimate cre to create a complete bill of materials, which is going to give you all the material you're going to need, the tooling you're going to need, labor time, a setup programming, and all the non-machining requirements that you've included uh, in the estimate. So you can be ready when the job hits the shop floor. Uh, we can create a packing slip. So you can uh, use the estimate to create a packing slip to ship off with the parts that when you deliver them. Uh, if you want, you can create an invoice uh, right directly from QTE from the estimate that you've created. So this is an outline of how QTE works. We go through, we estimate the cost, we create a quotation, and then we can order process through the bill of materials, uh, the packing slip, and the invoice.